Well, the deadly Arctic blast we saw yesterday in the Midwest is now heading toward the Northeast. Maggie Ruley has the latest on this polar vortex. Bone chilling cold is sweeping from the Midwest into the Northeast. It's freezing cold. My face, my toes, even though I'm layered, it don't matter. The Detroit River frozen over. In Chicago, wind chills dipping to negative 52, the coldest in more than three decades. ABC's Alex Perez is experiencing another day of these temps that are downright dangerous. Part of what makes this cold so dangerous is that it is lingering. When it's all said and done, Chicago will have been under this brutal cold for more than 80 hours. In upstate New York. What's happening there? High wind and heavy snow bringing white out conditions so bad you can barely see but you can clearly hear cars crashing into one another. <laughs> Officials are now banning trucks on certain roads. If you violate the law in this situation you can be endangering human lives. The storm turning deadly. It's claimed multiple lives including 18 year old University of Iowa student Gerald Belts. Overnight here in New York City, we saw the coldest temps of the season so far, but there is some good news. Starting tomorrow, we're expecting temperatures to warm up for most of the country. Maggie Verley, ABC News, New York.